For at least a year now, my viewers have been asking for, if not demanding, a battery review of something other than a 12 and 24 volt battery. It's been like, enough of the 12 and 24 volt battery. Give us a 48 or 51 volt battery review. Well, today is the day. I have a gorgeous new 51.2 volt battery by Novak, and we are gonna be talking about this extensively today. We're gonna to go over everything. We're gonna go over the discharge. We're gonna go over the construction, exterior. We're gonna open it up and look at the BMS, the wiring. We're gonna talk about everything about this battery. And something I haven't done in a while is an actual unboxing because this battery came shipped like it was precious archeological finds from Egypt. It is amazing how they shipped this battery. So stay tuned. We're gonna have a lot of fun today. We're gonna to get into this 51 volt battery and see what it is like. I personally hate unboxing videos where they just show a battery coming out of a cardboard box. It's like, who cares? We've all seen that a million times. But I just had to show you this. This is a wooden crate and it's because this battery is over 100 pounds and they want to ship it safely. And it is just absolutely phenomenal. It's like opening up a treasure. And it is a treasure because this battery is gorgeous. And I don't want to spend too much time on this, but I just, I had to show you how incredibly well shipped and packed this battery is. So if you think the shipping box is impressive, wait until we get into the actual battery. Steel case, built like a tank. So it comes with a manual, heavy duty charger, and the screen. I'm gonna put the tech specs up on the video, but I do wanna hit a couple of really, really important things. First of all, it's 110 pounds, so it is a big boy. It has Eve cells. They can do 400 cycles at 80% depth of discharge, but I really wanna focus on the output. It has a recommended continuous discharge of 105 amps, which is what you'd expect, but this is where it gets really cool. Maximum continuous discharge, 200 amps, but it gets better. Peak discharge current for 30 seconds, 315 amps but that's not the end. Peak current discharge, three seconds, 600 amps. Now this is designed for a golf cart. And that means that when you're going up that hill in your golf cart, it is just gonna have all of the power there to push you up that hill. So it's an incredibly powerful battery that can output a ton of energy. So wiring this up was very straightforward. As you can see, it's obviously all wired up now, but it was very simple to attach the screen and the heavy duty charger, it didn't take any time at all. Very intuitive, the manual has a diagram, explains it all. So the heavy duty charger is beefy and feels substantial. But what I really liked about it was the fan is actually relatively quiet. It's quieter than a lot of the power stations that I test. Now here's a close up of the screen. This is the warning page, it shows you all the warnings, it shows you the current, the voltage, the state of charge. Now I've just charged it up, so of course it's 100% in green. If it was charging, you would see the amount of current coming in. Of course, it shows the temperature. It is a touch screen, so let's click through. There's more information. The manual explains every one of these screens in detail. Here is the cell voltage, all 16 cells. And then check this out. Four cell temperature sensors, incredible. Here is the configuration. You can change the system language and system time. Let's, oh, and you can also look at all of your alarm history. And we'll go back to the default page. And again, the manual explains all of this in great detail. The exterior of the battery is impressive from the welded feet to the handles. Very nice, impressive steel case on this battery. Now let's open it up and see what's inside. All right, that's all the screws. Let's open this up. I'm got to tell you, I'm kind of excited to do this because um, I'm really interested to see what this looks like. And I'm opening up this for the first time. You're seeing it when I'm seeing it. Impressive, just off the top. Just look at this. This is beautiful. Very, very impressive build quality. So you can see there's a gasket that goes all the way around the box where those screws are so it's watertight looks like there's a class T fuse right there of uh, just really really nice wiring everything looks clean and tight um, 
impressive build. Uh, if anyone sees anything, let me know. Uh, I would love to hear what you think because uh, this looks really, really nice. Like every other battery, the BMS is the brains of the battery. And a battery is only as good as the BMS. And this is not a FET-based BMS. This is a contactor-controlled EV-grade BMS. And that's why you can get those amazing amperage out of this battery. Just look at these gorgeous cells one more time. Look at these bus bars. Look at this wiring. I mean, just look. Look at, look at that bus bar. Look at how clean and neat and orderly and professional. I mean, I'll say it again. This, this is a Craftsman battery. This is put together by somebody who really, really cares. And I do so many battery teardowns, and this just stands out. That's why I'm just uh, amazed at it. I just, it's just, a, it's like art. And you get this T-class fuse, heavy, thick bus bars, incredible BMS, gorgeous Eve cells, Ah, just, just a great battery. Well, this was the most expensive video I've ever done because now my wife wants to go out and buy a golf cart since we have this beautiful battery now. <laughs> uh, I'm kind of kidding about that, but really I wish I did have a golf cart so I could actually do a real load test on it because the build quality on it was absolutely amazing. I did a capacity test. It hit the 5376 watt hours as I expected. Nothing worth filming there. It was like two days worth because I have a very slow old tester. But the battery is incredible. And yeah, I don't know anything about golf cart batteries, but I do know battery builds. I've done a lot of battery teardowns and the build quality on this battery is outstanding. So if you are looking to upgrade the battery on your golf cart, this is the way to go. It comes with a monitor, it comes with a charger. It's incredibly well built. It's solid. It can output hundreds and hundreds of amps. If anyone has any questions about you saw, let me know. I don't know how much I can answer because, again, I'm not a golf cart battery expert. But uh, leave a comment and uh, we can have a conversation at least. If anyone's used a different kind of golf cart battery, has something to add, please feel free to do that too. Thanks for watching. As always, like, comment, share, subscribe. It really helps out the channel. And I will talk to everyone soon.